hello guys uh, in this video I will show you how to get started with enterprise minor so basically just very basic stuff about how cre how do you create a project how do you read in a data set and basically get started to um, st get started with analyzing your data set so uh, what what I'm going to do is first I'll create a new project in order to create a new project you just go in here uh, give the project a name I'm going to call it AF uh, demo and select a directory on the server where you want to uh, be saving all the material uh, for your project so I have already created a folder which I will use to create which I will use to save the uh, project related material so I will just create this uh, I will just select this folder and say open um, next and just say finish okay so this is how your uh, first screen looks like this is a project that has been created by the name of AF demo that I just created and the next thing that we are going to do is basically we want to read in data sources you want to create a diagram and things like that but before that uh, what we will do is we'll create a library where we will store all the data sets uh, that we will be using in this project so in order to do that I'll go to file new uh, file new and I will say library create new library and I will name a library uh, let's call it demo data and I'll select the path to the folder uh, which has all my data sets it's better to create it's always a good practice to create a folder uh, especially dedicated for keeping all your data sets so you just need to uh, select the folder only the folder in which your data sets will be found and say open okay and you want to say next and uh, once you once the library has been successfully created it will say action succeeded the library demo data was created and you need to say finish okay after linking the library the next thing that I will do is I will read in the data source that I want to analyze so I will I can just click on uh, you know right click on the data source and say create data source now this will say SAS table the data that I have is a SAS table so I'll just say yes and I'll browse to the library that I have just created um, you know the library which is right here and if you click on the library you will see the data sets that are placed inside the library this data set is about uh, demographic information um, you know about which was collected from a consensus uh, a census uh, that happened in the US so I'm going to select this data set and say OK and say next next here you will get a screen which will say metadata advisor options for now just click on advanced and just follow the steps there are two options here one is basic one is advanced we just select advanced next this screen basically shows you all the variables that are there in your data set um, and some details about the variables like uh, what role will they play in your analysis and what is the level of the variable so if it is an interval variable versus if it is a nominal variable it gives you information about that so what I will do here is that I will just go ahead and select this variable called salary and change the role to target and then say next um, I do not want to give any decision uh, with values for processing at the moment so just select no uh, do not create a sample say no here and then everything else is okay just say next and finish so once this is done successfully you will see that your data will be listed under the data sources category now the next thing to do is just right click on diagram say create new diagram and again I will call it AF demo AF demo and uh, or I could basically call it uh, adult demo data 
so demographic data about the as adults from the US and say okay so here you see this is basically the screen uh, which you know represents this diagram and this is where you will be doing a lot of things uh, basically here you see all these tabs these are the tasks that you can basically explore uh, using SAS Enterprise Miner and uh, during the duration of the course we'll get acquainted with quite a few of these we will be focusing on um, on, on um, nodes that are related to model section here um, but more on that a bit la later but basically you are ready to start analyzing the data set.